what can you tell people about salvation about us being young and saved what are they missing out Philip? yeah i i believe personally the the most important thing is satisfaction like you you are satisfied with who you are because now you get to know who you, who you are when you know christ when, when you get to know who god is you get to know who you are that you are a sinner and god loved you just the way you are with your imperfection and actually you are qualified the moment you you identify that hey i can't do this from seriously seriously i can't i can't go to life mm-hmm. um i can't do it i need someone to help me i need a savior then he teaches you how to love you by loving him he mm-hmm. teaches you to to love you and to be contented to be contented by yourself so to love god even as you know how to love yourself and to be contented and of course that is the only way you will love other people and express Christ um reflect Christ in your life by being contented with who you are that hey I'm a sinner saved by grace not by works or anything else and loving yourself yeah. so so yeah obila tell us what what do they not know uh, uh i can say uh, we are the light of the world mm-hmm. uh, and this uh, refers to those who have given their life to Christ when they are hapo sikili hapo they are the light of the world mm-hmm. and then mm, to those who have given their life to Christ and then they are watching our, our show uh, it's good to give your life to Christ so that uh, when you give your life to Christ kuna mambo mingi yanaenda kuhappen kwa life yako Uh, the first thing they when they pata benefit mean me pata kupewa the holy spirit when you talk to kind of pray to you nyingi kwa life yako yeah as a day i had said in the first chapter 1 that in 14 yapo so the holy spirit when you talk pia hatapewa na tamsaidia kufanya mambo mengi sana and then another thing ni sala ile jumla kwa wala la dunia na wanyamoko amokoka pia eh do not love the things of the world because if you love the things of the, of the world mm-hmm. therefore the love of your father is not in you so it is good for us to uh, to realize to pen the god to pen the word and then uh, the last thing uh, which is very very important ni let's learn how to surrender our life to god let's learn how to ask god to show us the way the way hata kama ujokoka manzee i'm too good give me give me the way ataka ujoko kama ameto mungu akupatie hiyo hiyo the way ya ku follow and then you learn how to surrender your life to Christ so hiyo ndio naambia my fellow youths youth men yeah youth men mm. yeah una chenda that's funny it's funny yeah so um an encouragement to those who are born again first of all um The Bible says our labor in the Lord is not in vain. Yeah. So as a as a young person and and you're born again, mm-hmm. it's not in vain. It's not in vain. God pays. Mm-hmm. God pays. So kwa nyamya koka like for all of us here and those who are who will watch or are watching mm-hmm. God pays. There's payment in God as in and and it's not in vain. And then also we should we should be either hot or cold. I think that's a challenge I think that's in the church yeah especially in the for those uh, but let me address those who are born again mm-hmm. either be hot or cold either to kwa sewa god ama wasewa world mm. because now we are making we are making people to to ridicule the church we are making people to ridicule the gospel yeah. when you hear someone is in prison worship and they are and they are fornicating mm-hmm. that's spoiling the gospel so it's either will be hot or cold if it's god it's god if it's the world it's the world yeah. for those who are not born again they are first of all missing out on life because they will miss out on eternal life if they don't give themselves to god and also they are missing out on contentment for sure when you told the one alisema bila yesu ni vanity mm. they might have money they might have wako na do wako na big things major things in life but without jesus they don't have peace they have nothing they have nothing yeah. they have nothing literally so jesus gives peace he gives life he gives contentment he gives everything because the bible says he is everything everything mm-hmm. is in him and him is everything mm-hmm. so they are missing out on everything literally yeah. there's a yeah. quote i i saw that mm-hmm. says if you met me and you forgot me you lose nothing mm-hmm. but if you meet christ 
and you forget him yeah. you lose mm-hmm. everything. everything right and that's just amazing sure yeah because mm-hmm. we are here to evangelize not to be remembered mm-hmm. but to make god known and remembered yeah True. yeah um i'd like to read the bible there's a verse i read um it's in john john 17 jesus was praying and now he's playing alikuwa naombea his disciples mm-hmm. and this is what he was saying um but now i come to you and the things i speak in the world that they may have my joy fulfilled in themselves i have given them your word and the world has hated them because they are not of the world just as i am not of the world remember this is jesus praying i do not pray that you should take them out of the world but that you should keep them for the evil one ah sorry you should keep them yeah from the evil one they are not of the world just as i am not of the world sanctify them by your truth your word is truth you sent me into the world i also have sent them into the world and for their sakes i sanctify myself and that they also may be sanctified by the truth the other bible i was reading apo kwa pati nasema um we should keep them from evil from the evil one mm-hmm. the bible iyo inasema protect them mm-hmm. from the evil one mm-hmm. I, um that is something god has promised yes there will be trials and tribulations mm-hmm. in our christianity mm-hmm. but once you have given your life to christ mm-hmm. god has jesus has already interceded for you and said god protect them from the evil one mm-hmm. yes things will happen but god is still on your side god is still looking at you god is still protecting you mm-hmm. because jesus said so mm-hmm. so let me just tell you something that you will want to remember mm-hmm. john 3:16 says that for god so loved the world that he gave his only son that whoever believes in him will not perish but have everlasting life and then the son goes to the father and said god please protect them mm. from all evil mm-hmm. i don't know how much assurance you would need mm-hmm. but in christ he is the prince of peace that's why everyone here is talking about peace mm-hmm. he is the sovereign god he does what he pleases and he's not uh, influenced mm-hmm. by anything mm-hmm. yeah? and he is a god who is not a debt a data is it mm-hmm. a de- mm-hmm. a, de- a what data a data ha ha kangi na deni za watu ni kizungu ilikuja na meli and he is a god who will love you unconditionally he will love you regardless of everything you have done in psalms chapter 12 it says uh, as from the east as far as the east is from the west so has he forgiven and forgotten your sins for sure you will have people who will always remember what they did but mm-hmm. jesus but god says that when you to how far it is ndivo tu amesa how your story and with and they think we need such a person in our lives we need such a is it a person a, mm-hmm a god mm-hmm. we need such a god in our lives mm-hmm. someone who loves us mm-hmm. as we are mm-hmm. someone who accepts us mm-hmm. with everything that we are na me si dream bona how job focus time na dress si pressure but give your life to christ if you'd really love to give your life to christ i think the best words would be god i give you my life and from then on look for a church and plug in and start your journey start mm-hmm. your relationship with god yeah. amen amen haya haya and with that i'd really like to say kwa heri ya kuonana thank you for listening thank you for taking uh in interest mm-hmm. taking interest uh kwa kutusikiliza kwa kutake your time i hope you have learned something i hope 
umeokoka kama umeokoka um good for you god loves you and and the angels are celebrating exactly kwaherini <laughs> <laughs> oh, bye bye